everybody so today i am in the city of westminster in socal i am here standing in front of a shinobu japanese barbecue so i know you guys have heard of korean barbecue i eat it all the time but japanese barbecue is a whole different experience and this is the only place in socal you can get for all you can eat all you can eat Japanese barbecue. That's some top quality meat here. They have they offer a A5 Miyazaki Wagyu cut here that I cannot wait to try. And of course, try out their other amazing premium cuts as well. Actually, Mike Chen, one of my favorite food YouTubers, came here before and he absolutely loved it. So I'm super excited to experience this for myself and take you guys along with me. So let's go inside and check it out. Yay! So here it is, that's where it's listed and it also comes with all these different ones. Um, there's even scallops available, that's crazy. So they have so many different appetizers including beef carpaggio, that's really fancy. Uh, crispy Wagyu beef buns, that sounds really good. So it includes all the ones from this, the gold menu as well. So all these, all these meat cuts are available to you and so many different appetizers and side dishes, wow. Here comes all the food that I ordered. Oh my God, I am so excited. Look at all that. We got some side dishes. Look at those meat cuts. Oh my God, is that the A5? That's the A5 Miyazaki Oh Wagyu. my gosh, wow. Look at all that. Beef belly, some wrapped asparagus. Amazing. More meat on this side. Wow. I'm so ready to eat. Some marinated stuff as well. Cool. Wow, and those are all the appetizers on that side. We got the pork buns that I was looking at. And the shishito peppers, tonkatsu. Oh my gosh. This looks so good. I cannot wait to get started on all this. So I just got a little bit of rundown about what everything is. This is their Kobe beef trio plate. We got some bacon fried rice, we have the beef carpaccio, we got yakisoba, we got the ribeye. This is the truffle miso pork belly miso soup. Uh, this is uh, beef belly and we got brisket. I, I cannot wait to try that. That looks just so good. The A5 Wagyu. Um, this is bacon wrapped asparagus, bacon wrapped shrimp, some marinated short ribs, the pork buns again, shishito peppers and calamari. And yeah, no, this is uh, a, this looks good. This looks really good. All right, guys, I am so stoked to be trying this food out. Oh my gosh, this spread is absolutely incredible. Let me put my hair up and we are gonna start with the best because I cannot wait. The Miyazaki A5 Wagyu. Wow. Right, we're just gonna... I'm gonna put in a couple pieces first because I really want to savor this cut. Wow. I really want to try that so bad. And I'm actually going to cook it medium rare. Except for that fatty part, I'm going to cook that more well done. But this, and the metal part, I'm going to cook it medium rare. While we wait for that, let's try some of the yakisoba. It's with beef. Mmm! Oh! Wow! Mmm! Some veggies, the panchans. This is a truffle miso soup. Mm, okay. All right, let's flip this over. Woo, look at that sear. It's beautiful. Wow. Okay. All right, let's try out a piece of this tonkatsu as well. Some Japanese barbecue sauce and mustard. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Okay. I think that's ready. Okay. I'm let that cook more. I thought I should have a scissor, but anyway. Let's try. Oh my god. I just peeled it off and it's just so buttery. All right, let's try this out. Mm. Oh my God. Okay. That is legit beef. A5 meat just melts in your mouth. Oh my God. 
うんおまえがねしょおまえラップソネライスペーパー dip it in some sauce Wow, wow, wow. That's good meat. Okay. I am impressed. I am very impressed. Woo! Yes. Put in some bacon wrap asparagus. And some pork belly. In the meantime, I will actually try the beef carpaccio. This one, you, it's pretty much raw beef with flavor. And I will try it. Just to try it. Gotta try everything once. This is the bacon fried rice with a heart shaped egg. I don't know, that's so cute. Okay. Oh, that's good beef. Mm. It actually tastes like um, prosciutto. I am gonna grill a little bit. I know you're not supposed to cook it, but. I just can't handle raw stuff that well. I wanted to try it as it is. So there you go, I tried it. But this bacon rice is good, by the way. Mm. Try it out now, cook it a little bit. Oh, yeah. The sauce on it is really good. While we're waiting for that to cook, I'm gonna try one of these pork buns. Pork belly buns? Mmm. Oh my god. Oh. Wow. Dude, that pork belly here is so good. It's so fatty. And all the flavor comes together so well. Oh, the meat actually cooks really fast. That's good. Because I'm hungry. Okay. This is the fatty part of the A5 Wagyu. And I think this is done pretty much. Wow, these, the meat cooks so fast. I'm so impressed. I love it. Love it, love it. All right, let's try the fatty A5. Oh, oh my god. Oh. That is so good. And this is their fried calamari. Mm. Oh, wow. The texture on this is so good. Oh, this actually cooks so much faster than I thought it would. I got so much meat to eat already. I'm gonna put in the bacon wrap strip. So much bacon. A lot of pork. Mmm. Well, that's good. All right, this is the pork belly. Wrapping it in some rice paper is going to taste so good. side here this is the shishito pepper so shishito pepper actually isn't spicy at all it loses a lot of flavor all right well i 
cannot believe the pace that I am going here. This is awesome. This is the short rib I'm going to put on here. Short ribs takes a little longer. I know why it doesn't give you scissors. Because all their meat is so tender, you don't have to cut it. At Korean barbecue, they typically give you scissors. I keep looking for the scissors, but I'm like, oh, I don't even need it because I bite into this. But the meat comes out, like, I can chew through it. Mm. So easily. Mm. Uh, wrapping in like daikon and rice paper tastes so good. I just asked for a picture of Diet Coke. I didn't want to keep bothering them, so here I am with my picture of Diet Coke. <laughs> and I am really, really impressed with this brand. They actually have like a um, shabu place just like four doors down. So I'm gonna come back to that one and try that out as well because I love eating hot pot. And their quality is actually so good. I wanna see how their all you can eat hot pot will be like. I don't even know if they have, maybe they have Wagyu there too. It should, right? Same brand, serve the same stuff. But no, this is, this is really good. Mm. Oh, there's some corn cheese. Look at that. Ooh, cheese pull. Ooh. Wrap that corn cheese around my shrimp. I'm gonna add in, this is the Kobe Trio. So I'm gonna lightly grill these pieces. This is for quality meat. Okay, my beef, rib, beef bellies. Beef rib, beef rib. Short rib. <laughs> no, I'm losing. I'm losing my mind. I'm just so excited to eat. Okay, there we go. All right, let's get through these ribs and bacon. medium well, I mean medium rare, so I don't want to overcook this. Just a little sear and then it should be good. In the meantime, I will try one of these short ribs. Oh my god. Mm. No. The marination is so good. Wow. All, right, all these Kobe is done. And I don't know if you guys can see this, but this little thing is actually a ventilation. So everything is going up in there. So it's not getting me all oily, you know? 
I really appreciate that because I hate it when I smell like complete meat after Korean barbecue or in this case Japanese barbecue. similar to the wagyu almost it's really buttery yes. really flavorful i like to wrap it in wrap paper right now you have no idea I'm gonna have the ribeye steak meat next ribeye cuts Besides the A5 Wagyu, it's actually this marinated short rib. It's actually so flavorful. It's a little sweet, savory. Mm. I really like the teriyaki glaze. Mm. I worked out this morning, so I'm really excited to get all this protein in, you know? actually one of my favorite vegetables to eat. That's how I'm almost done with it. I love eating these stuff. Okay, I'm gonna let that cook a little bit on the side while I add in some beef belly. I love beef belly. Fatty meat is so good. I'm actually so surprised I got through all like the side dishes so fast. It's like the small dishes. I guess it's me eating barbecue. I eat barbecue pretty fast. I eat a lot of meat really fast. Okay. All right. Looks like my beef, beef belt, beef rib, beef, beef ribeye. <laughs> I'm already like my head's full of meat. I can't even think anymore. Ribeye meat. Here we go. Oh, oh 
ya. Mas, bos. doing this because it tastes good. Some rice paper, the daikon radish, eat it with the meat like this. Oh, so good. By the way, you totally can ask for a grill change. I'm just choosing not to because I really like the charred flavor. That's just a personal preference. I'm pretty sure the restaurant does want to change it, but I told them, don't worry about it. I like all this frick flavor. YOLO, you know what I mean? I like what I like. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna eat it the way I like it. even. I totally forgot what that was. One of them is brisket, one of them is beef belly. I don't know. It's meat. I'm gonna eat it. Honestly, we're pretty much done. I'm gonna save that for some uh, video content later, but I will finish that. Don't worry. I, I am eating that. You know what? Perfect. Okay. Just in time. Let's do that. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, you can save the dishes. Okay. Yeah, thank you, thank you. So I told you, their service is on point. They see this, it's like, oh no, she needs a grill train. Oh, this one is good. I think this is the beef belly. Mm. Oh my god. I love that one. Wow. God, the beef belly is amazing.
Thank you so much. That one has so much beef oil on it. <laughs> I'm gonna eat all these daikon too. These daikon and like bean sprouts are just so freaking good. So good. I, I feel like these side dishes are like so necessary when you go to barbecue because you really need a balance, you know? Having like all this meat and oil at once, you really need something to pair well with. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to take everything out and put it here. Okay, and that should be good. Continue on eating the rest of this. Awesome. And I'm going to film myself eating the rest of that for TikTok. Alright guys, so excuse me for a second. I did it. All these meat plates, they are gone. This was an incredible experience here at Shinobu Japanese Barbecue. Oh, that actually filled me up. That was actually a really good meal. And because I didn't have too much carbs other than like a lot of rice paper, um, I don't feel like terrible. Meat doesn't fill you up nearly as much as like overall rice or noodles. So that was an incredibly amazing meal, really high quality meat. If you're a fan of Japanese Barbecue, I definitely recommend you coming here. But again, like I said, I saw Mike Chen come here and he absolutely loved the place. So I was like, I had to go try it and I love it too. So hopefully you guys can make it out here. If you do, let them know I sent you. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go get yourself some Miyazaki A5 Wagyu, guys. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Make sure to like and subscribe. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And make sure to check out my website for all my merchandise. I've got clothing, prints, and stickers all up on there. And make sure to check out my social media, my Facebook page. Um, I do a lot of live streaming. And on my Instagram page, I do a lot of giveaways. And on my Twitter page, I also give a shout out to where I might be so you guys can kind of follow me on my journey, okay? And then check out my other videos. And again, make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.